So Paul, disappointing result I'm sure for your team today, but what did you make of the performance overall? Look, I can't, I can't fault the players for, for the performance today. They, they dominated proceedings and, and had Sterling on the back foot from, from the word go. So, look, yeah, a very disappointing result for us. Um, it's just that, that lack of, of being clinical in the final third today really cost us. Um, I, but credit to, to Chloe and goals um, for, for Sterling. She had a, a good performance and she, she kept us out. But we just need to be taking those chances in the final third. But dominated proceedings from start to finish. In terms of the way you started, Chloe made I think one fantastic save in particular. Yeah. But you know, if you score those goals, it changes the whole complexion of the game, doesn't it? That's it. It's like the first. I think it was the first five, six minutes of the game. We had two or three opportunities, and going in at half time, it's kind of what we said: is we've just got to keep going and going and keep being relentless, keep being ruthless with them, and and just going. And our chances will come, and and we've just got to make sure that we take those chances. But today we didn't. So look, it's it's a hard one to swallow. But we'll 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 continue to work and keep creating these chances. In terms of, of watching the game, as you said, you know, Spartans dominated large spells of the game, played some really nice stuff. So uh, as a coach, I guess, you know, you've got loads of aspects correct. It's just that final bit. And I take it you'll use the break now maybe to work on those aspects? Yeah, well, the girls deserve a bit of a break. So we'll, we'll be off um, for, for a, a couple of weeks um, just to get that in. Probably around about 12 days, I think, in total we're off. And then we'll come back in and we'll, we'll start to recharge the batteries and get things going. We've got a, a couple of games already scheduled in what you could call the the mini pre-season that is the, the summer break and then we start the league again. So, look, it's all to play for. It's a tight league. But look, the, the challenge is on and, and, look, there's nothing saying that we can't do that and overcome that challenge and start to creep back up the table. In terms of obviously the goals as well that Sterling scored, both penalties, I know you were disappointed with, with the second one in particular. I mean, yeah. it's hard to, to concede when you lose goals like that as well, and it's hard to take. Oh, 100%. Like the, the players don't deserve that. The players deserve better. So, look, it is, it's a decision that's been made during the game, and, and we've just got to go with it. It's nothing that we can control just now when we're in the heat of the moment. And in terms of, as well, you've got the break now to, to revitalise the players. What will the, the aims or ambitions be for, for the remainder of the seasons for Spartans? I think the main thing is, is like you've seen the performance we've put in today. Is like it's a very, uh, a very disciplined and controlled performance from from back to front. You could say it's just we've got to work on that final third and start to be a little bit more clinical and take these chances. We built up very well through the thirds today. Got a good identity, good style of play, but it's just needing to make sure that we take these chances that we've got. So something we're definitely going to be working on in pre-season um, or in that summer break, you could say, um, and then be ready to go as the the second half of the season comes in.